Today I'm going to show you how to save your video from After Effects into a format that your iPhone can download and view, and some general tips to think about while doing this. The first thing uh, we want to do is to open the After Effects program, and here in the panel I have the files. Uh, click on the one that you want to export, and open the composition settings in the menu here. You'll want to make sure that the pixel aspect ratio is set to square pixels instead of one of the others. Otherwise, the video will be stretched out. You'll want to export uh, the file, and you can do that by, by clicking the file and then export. You can use uh, both the Adobe Media Encoder and the Render Cube. I usually just use the Render Cube because uh, when you export the file here, you will get the file in point .mov, and uh, this file can't be viewed on the iPhone. So we're going to convert it into a .mp4 video format, which I phone can view. So I googled this and I found that a lot of people use the program called Handbrake. So I download it and that's what we're going to use. So we'll just open it up. I got it in this window here and I just double clicked it. And as I always do, I just drag the movie I want to convert into the screen. Like this. And here we have it. Uh, the first thing we are going to do is to double check the dimensions. Uh, when I first downloaded the program, it was set to automatic, so you can't see it now, but the, the video was cropped weirdly. So I had to set it to custom and then zero out on all of these numbers. And you may need to do that too. And once you've done that, you'll choose where you'll save uh, the video. Down here, you can choose browse and then just choose one. And what you want to name it. And then you'll just click start and the video will be converted to .mp4. And I clicked in the box for uh, web optimization because I'm going to post it on the web. You'll have your files ready to view and download. Uh, you can see here when I open it up that it works perfectly and the quality is very good. What I usually do is uh, just either here or right click and choose uh, share. Now this is in Swedish, but it'll probably just say share if you have the computer in English. And I usually use airdrop and share it to my iPhone right away. And you don't have to do anything. The file will open up in your phone and be ready to be viewed. Thank you for watching this video.